Yo, what's up? Today I'll rank all bosses from Kingdom Hearts Fragmentary Passage. Only 8 bosses here and that's counting the rematches, so we're in for a midnight snack. Number 1, Phantom Aqua 2. The second encounter is easy than the first. Here she literally does nothing except throwing the ice things at you. Maybe it was the RNG or something that caught up, but yeah, she lets you hit. Number 2, Phantom Aqua 1. The first encounter is harder because she actually attacks. Other than the ice, she tries to get her hands on you, but that's as far as difficulty goes here. Number 3, Demon Tower 2. Easier than the first one because you have Mickey on your side. His team attack is pretty good. You literally teleport at the enemies, then using Mickey's ball steals good damage. It's still the same as the first fight, but you have Mickey on your side, which means more things to deal with, bro. Number 4, Demon Tower 1. The first fight against this thing is harder. You don't have Mr. Mickey to protect you, so you gotta deal with your problems alone. But that's about it. Number 5, Phantom Aqua 3. The third encounter against Aqua is the hardest because she uses everything she knows about such a strong and independent woman. Number 6, Dark Side. Opposed to the other games where he's the easiest boss around, he still has kind of the same moveset like summoning his kids to the arena and shooting darkness from his P organ. Uh, you can take bro out after bonking his head enough or arm as well. Number 7, Dark Side Army. Dark Side came back with an army that gives him background support. He's still the same guy, taking advantage of child labor and using his P organ as efficiently as possible. But the guys in the background also do their thing. There's this rain or whatever that happens once in a while. There's also balls falling from the sky, which you gotta dodge just to reach the battle arena in the first place and also sometimes during the fight, so go ahead and take the whole family out. Number 8, Demon Tai. The final boss is the hardest, almost to no surprise. He uses everything from the others, like summoning little kids to fight and drawing balls from the sky, and he also has a tornado and stuff. It's still the Demon Tower from the beginning, like swimming around the arena and whatnot. At least you have Mickey for emotional support, and at the end of the day you just hit this thing with the Keyblade until you're done. Then Mickey loses his shirt, abandons Aqua in the realm of darkness, and she accepts her eternal misery until Sora comes to the rescue. That's it for today. If you agree with anything, let me know. See ya.